up, guys? You know who it is, man. Um, JB, the chef ant, you know what I'm saying? Got a new and improved chef right here. About to make, you know, my homemade pizza. So, uh, it's gonna look good. Y'all gonna want it, but only I'm gonna get to enjoy it. So, stay tuned. Put that heat on, man. So we're gonna get the oven on. No, put it on 450. Let that preheat. So what's up, guys? Uh, you know, I'm gonna go through the toppings right here. This is this is big for me because I like pizza, but I'm I'm really picky. So now I get to make it my own way. Um, get to make it my own thing. So right here we got the you know what I'm saying the mozzarella sauce. We got the cheese. Um, Alicia loves my fiance. She loves pineapples on the pizza, so I'm gonna make her one with the pineapples. And then I like the mushrooms, uh, the banana peppers and onions, and then we got the bacon cooking right here. So you know what I'm saying? We're gonna get everything going. A little pepperoni right here. Got to show you this, so it's gonna be something special, so stay tuned. You know what I'm saying? The flour, you're gonna get you got to put the dough down, we gotta make sure it's all set. So right now we forming the crust. Gonna get that nice piece of crust that we like. I'm more of a uh, a thin crust guy, so we're gonna get it nice and thin, but still give that kind of thick, you know, uh, crust edge. So you dry the bus, get the crust out. I'm probably gonna, you know what I'm saying, crash, but we gotta start from somewhere. Ah, gotta get it again. Oh my, yeah, see, we got it one step at a time for me. Oh my goodness. You're next. Okay. Special, man. Okay. I, I do it all. We're man. getting there. You see what's going on in here, man? We making beats. <laughs> yes, sir. Ah, it's broken. Did a little too much flipping or a little too aggressive. And I put a hole in the pizza, but that's fine. All we're gonna do is we're gonna push pull over right here and we're gonna press down just like in life. When the situation is going wrong, you don't panic, you just fill the hole, put a little pressure on it. In life, we don't feel pressure. We put pressure, and that's what we're gonna do with this pizza to fill the hole. Put a little pressure down. So now we're on the toppings. You know, start with the sauce. It's whatever you like, you know. Put a little bit of sauce, or a lot of sauce. You know me, I'm big on the flavor. And I got that sauce. You know that? You need the sauce in your life. You know what I'm saying? A little bit of flavor. And we're gonna go to tight circle. We're gonna just wind that out. It's something Mr. Miyagi would have you doing. You know? This ain't the wax on, wax off. This is the big circle. Little circle, the big circle. You know? It's all about life. Peace is all about life. So now we place the spinach on here, sprinkle it on here, and we put it on here before the cheese so it so it doesn't burn the spinach. You know? It's like a protection layer. Let's spread the spinach out a little bit. You're a natural, man. Come on, man. I it's one of them things, when you make plays, you make plays, I'm going off the court. All right. Start with the cheese, you know. I like to start going on the outside in. Some me and Chef Ant talked about. We had a meeting about, you know, what's, what's better inside out. And I think if you start out, I'm telling everybody the secrets, but sometimes they'll notice the cheese if it's not on the outside, but they won't notice it if it's in the end. We gonna put cheese everywhere though. It's just chef problems, you know. Ooh, this pizza look like it's about to be something special. <laughs> Ooh. We gonna put a little bit of onions. I'm not big on onions, but I like the flavor, you know. So we just gonna we just gonna dip and dab a little bit of the onions. We call this right here, this piece right here is called the JV Supreme, you know? Um, so we gotta put a little bit of everything on there. Actually, put a little bit more onions in it. All right, put some mushrooms. I mean, I like mushrooms because I think they're healthy. Ain't they healthy? Yep. And that's what I mean, that's why I put them on there. And they not really for me, they for, they for the health. To counteract the bacon. Hey, yeah, Davis wanna like me eating bacon. All about balance, right? Balance. Then yeah. banana peppers. I like the splash of flavor. You put a little bit, not too many that it, that it takes over the whole meal. You know, but just a little something. It's a JB Supreme. And then we gotta finish it with the bacon. You know what I'm saying? It's all about the bacon. Uh-huh. Bacon 
it's halfway cooked, you know, so it can cook in the oven as well. I know y'all want some of this. <laughs> ooh, ooh, I forgot to put the pepperoni on there, but it's okay. I'm gonna just fill it in places where the pepperoni, it's not a lot of, you know, uh, other ingredients there, so it don't take over the whole pizza, you know. I'm trying to be balanced, because in life, like I was telling you, giving you life lessons, life is all about balance. I don't gotta go to the restaurants no more. That's what this is. We don't go, we don't go to Domino's. We go to JB's. <laughs> you gotta love it, man. It's off the top of the head. JB's Pizzeria. <laughs> Kizzy so, free or JB's? Kizzy free, Kizzy free for sure. All right, <laughs> so um, Chef Ant, you know, he, he put me on a valuable lesson right here. And I got a heavy hand, so I'll do it like this. Instead of putting the, 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 the peppers on after, we put it on before, you know, give it a little flavor, give it a little spice, let everything, you know, uh, come out together, special. Oh, uh, just that little bit. Yes. yes. That's how you're elevating it. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. That's how you elevate I like that. And then, you know, get a little bit of garlic salt. You know, I definitely got a heavy hand for this. So I'm like, I'm gonna just, yeah, that's gonna be good. I think I need a little bit more garlic salt. I think I need, that's gonna be too good. There you go. Now this may be the most important part. You gotta finish with the cheese to give it that crisp, nice look. You know, almost high what you're eating. You take the bite and it's like, oh, I forgot I put the banana peppers in there. You know? That, that finish look. It's all about finish. We're all just trying to be the finished product. Another life lesson. Let's take a look and you know, get a little masterpiece. This is the first one we made. And we're going to put it in the oven for 12 minutes. And halfway through, we're going to spin it so it's balanced. Just like I was saying, in every part of life, got to be balanced. So in six minutes, we're spinning the pizza. Get a nice little spin. We see we have a bubble right here in the pizza. So we just take a knife. Poke a hole right in there. Bring that down. And that's it. Let it finish cooking. 12 minutes up. We're gonna take it out. See, get a little look. So we like to just check it out. See what it looks like at the bottom. See if it got a little bit of brown. Not too much, so I think we might put it back in for a little bit. You know, let it cook for maybe another two, three minutes. And then we'll be ready to eat. So it's been a few minutes, man. We're gonna go back and check this pizza out. I'm excited. Whew. Look at that, man, goodness. Take a look, see if it looks. Yeah, we getting there. What you think, Ant? I think that's gonna be good. Yeah, we gonna be all right. So, so now, we let that breathe for a little bit and then we'll cut it. And then, you know, we'll eat good after that. So right here, now we get the cut, we're getting closer to the big moment. Ooh, this is gonna be so good. Now we're gonna shift it over here. All right, so now we almost done. Put a little bit of Parmesan on here. Let's take a look at that. So now, man, this is the moment we've been waiting for, man. Oh my goodness! Hey, JB's Pizza, man. Our kids eat free. 